All right, thank you, Art. Vice President Kamala Harris made history last night as she became the first woman of color to accept the presidential nomination for a major political party. Caroline Cummings is in Chicago with more on the big close to the Democratic National Convention. I promise to be a president for all Americans. Vice President Kamala Harris called for unity as she accepted the Democratic nomination for president. She hit on many of the top voter issues, including the border, blaming former President Donald Trump for pressuring Republicans to torpedo a deal. As president, I will bring back the bipartisan border security bill that he killed, and I will sign it into law. Harris also addressed the economy, reproductive rights, and the war in Gaza. Now is the time to get a hostage deal and a ceasefire deal done. And the former prosecutor went after Trump on foreign policy. Trump won't hold autocrats accountable because he wants to be an autocrat himself. There was a heavy emphasis on domestic issues, including respect for veterans and gun violence. But for many, the highlight was seeing Harris make history as the first black and South Asian woman atop a major party presidential ticket. As a woman myself, as a mother, as a black person, it's just been just an incredible, incredible night. Harris is expected back on the campaign trail next week. In just over two weeks, she's set to face off against Trump in a debate. Caroline Cummings, CBS News, Chicago. Pink and the Chicks performed during last night's program. There was a lot of speculation and anticipation that Beyonce would make a surprise appearance after TMZ reported it, but that did not materialize. 